Green at the time could possibly have foreseen the implications of the Ginsburg Kesey failure to persuade the Hells Angels to join forces with the radical left in Berkeley. The final split came at Altamont four years later. But by that time, it had long been clear to everybody except a handful of rock industry dopers and the national press. The orgy of violence at Altamont merely dramatized the problem. The realities were already fixed. The illness was understood to be terminal. And the energies of the movement were long since aggressively dissipated by the rush to self-preservation. Ah, this terrible gibberish. Grim memories and bad flashbacks looming up from the time fog of Stanion Street. No solace for refugees, no point in looking back. The question, as always, is now what? <laughs>